Hello ladies and gentlemen. My name is Dr Carly Seddon and I am the Dean of the School of Computing and Academic Studies at the British Columbia Institute of Technology or BCIT for short. Thank you for inviting me to give an address at this very important event. I bring to you today greetings from both the Chairman and the President of BCIT and their warmest congratulations to the Chairman, the President and all the faculty, staff and students at your college. Today we are honouring the achievements of the 2010 graduating class of the Joint International Diploma in Computer Systems and Technology. For you the graduates, your success is the result of your hard work, dedicated study and perseverance. You have much to be proud of. Today is your special day as we celebrate your accomplishments. To you, the graduating class of 2010, let me congratulate you on your achievement. Congratulations first of all on choosing a profession that will provide you with a rewarding and satisfying career. The skills and knowledge you have learned will serve you well over the years. Let me further congratulate you on the hard work dedication and devotion you have put into your studies. Achievement does not happen on its own. You have earned your diplomas through diligent work and study. I would also like to say thank you to all the parents, family and friends who are here today and who have supported you, the graduates, during your career. On behalf of the graduating class, I salute all who have sustained and championed the students graduating today. We are in the age of lifelong learning. Technology changes every day and your future learning must keep up with it. An important part of your education therefore, and perhaps the most important part, is to learn how to learn so you can keep your knowledge current and applicable. I hope every one of you will consider continuing your education either in Korea or perhaps one day in Canada at BCIT. As you enter the modern workforce, it is very likely that you will travel broadly and to different countries, meeting new peoples and experiencing new cultures and languages. Your ability to work with people from diverse backgrounds is just as important as your technical job skills. This brings me to reflect on why this graduation ceremony is so important. In English, the word used to describe the graduation ceremony of the university or college is convocation. This means a gathering of people for an important reason. Today, the 2010 graduates of your college are in this convocation for an important reason, to look to a prosperous and successful future for all. Today's convocation also adds to all the other past convocations held by your college during its proud history. And because of our collaboration, today's convocation also joins in spirit this college's graduates with the 5,000 students who will graduate this year at BCIT in Canada and indeed with over a hundred thousand students who have graduated from BCIT over its own history. I would now like to read out the names of today's graduates. Seong Jun Bei, Su Ji Han, Ga Yong Hyo, Yu Mi Ji, Kwang Hyong Jo, Hun Sung Kang, Mi Ji Kang, Dong Yun Kim, Hyun Young Kim, Kyung Hyun Kim, Myung Jae Kim, Ak Hyun Kim, Sang Min Lee, Si Lim Lee, Hyung Young Park, Sang Jun Park, Su Yong Park, Won Cho Shin, Ju Yong Sin, once again, many congratulations to you all. Thank you, and I wish you every success in the future. And I hope you enjoy the rest of today's celebrations. Goodbye.